you were to research the BMW family tree, it would be easy to draw a dotted line from the subject of this test back to the 2002. But few would have looked at the bolt to bright, seminal 1968 offering and predicted that it would evolve into the slinky, sexy 2015 428i X drive. Okay, we see the twin kidneys in the grille in the blue and white propeller badge, but as for everything else? By any measure, the 4 Series is a looker. Longer, lower, and wider than its 3 Series sedan sibling, the two-door coupe features the same lightweight chassis, excellent weight balance, and pinpoint body control. Put one of these in your driveway and few will question your purchase decision. Squint a bit and you can see the Al conquering M4. But the subject of this test is the 428i X drive, the intra level version with all wheel drive. A 2.0 litre 4 cylinder turbo works under hood, producing 240 horsepower and 255 lbft of torque. An 8 speed automatic ably handles cog zuffling duties. A manual gearbox isn't available with the four-cylinder and AWD. Slush box or not, the 428i X drive is no laggard in the acceleration department, even with an extra 150 or so pounds of X drive gear, the 428i banged off a solid 5.5 second 0 to 60 mph time. Only a few tenths behind the last rear drive 435i we tested. And EPA City Highway ratings of 2,233 miles per gallon make it the thrifty choice among AWD 4 Series coupes, 2 to 3 miles per gallon less thirsty than the 435i's Turbo 6. We've had good things to say about the 4 Series in general and this 4-cylinder turbo in recent tests of the rear drive 428i, the 428i Grand Coupe, and the 328i X Drive Sport Wagon. But this time, in the 428i X Drive, we came away with mixed emotions. Is the 428i X Drive a luxury coupe or a performance coupe? Don't hate me because I'm beautiful taken as a performance coupe, the 428i's steering is still a bit vague and disconnected for our tastes. Our test car was equipped with the $1000 dynamic handling package, which adds variable sport steering and adjustable dampers. This removes some of the lightness at the helm and improves body control to previous Gen 3 series levels. But the all-season Pirelli Cinturato P7S that would otherwise not seem out of place on an all-wheel drive car don't help here. The 428i X drive needed 177 feet to stop from 70 miles per hour, only a foot less than that required by a recently tested, all-season shod Toyota Camry XSE. The brakes suffered and like moderate fade, too. As a luxury coupe, the otherwise a quiet four-cylinder AWD car has some noise and vibration issues. Over coarse surfaces and uneven pavement, hollow resonances from the front end of the $43,700 428i X drive don't do much to set a luxurious mood. There's some driver train rumble at low RPM when cruising at light throttle in the upper gears and the four-cylinder turbo is a little grainy and a brisk acceleration, something you don't notice with, say, the Volkswagen GTI's 2.0-litre turbo. So, if you're a luxury buyer at this price point, why wouldn't you ante up the extra $5,500 for the 435i and its 3.0-litre turbo, one of the creamiest engines under any car's hood? Why deny yourself the effortless torque of that engine? We wouldn't, although with either engine you do get those drop-D gorgeous looks.